Hi there, so I'm back finally after my very long hiatus. Very sorry that I uh, didn't kind of give anyone a heads up on this channel that I was going to be taking a break, but my life has just been really crazy over the past two months. And I said from the beginning, when I came back, this is a hobby, this is not my career. I'm doing this because I enjoy it and that my life and my family is you know, my top priority. So I may have to disappear for a while. You know, that's just how, how it is on this channel. But I'm back, I have so much to tell you. I'm so excited to share all of the incredible developments that have happened so rapidly in my life over the past three months. It's really, it's still very overwhelming to me, you know, everything that has happened, but it's all good. So, um, first things first, I am obviously in a new location. This is a different place than what you're used to seeing me and I have moved um, to a new place completely. There will no longer be sirens in my videos. Amen, hallelujah. This is one of the most amazing things. I'm so excited, I have left the city. I no longer um, am in an urban environment. I'm in a rural place. I have retreated to the countryside to find the good life. Um, this has been the most stressful thing that I have had to um, organize and endure over the past little while. Um, and it's it was the main reason why I needed to take a step back because it, you know, moving, moving to a new country, which I have moved to a new country, um, is, it's no small thing. And um, it was just a really big move. And my uh, husband, that was, that's the other big thing that's happened, I got married, um, you know, was working full time during the move. So it was just a lot of juggling, but we're here, Finally, I'm gonna do um, a little bit of a reveal of my location um, in my next video. There's still a few things that I just sort out before I want to reveal exactly where I am. Um, but the other big thing that has happened over the course of this um, little while is if you follow me on Twitter, you will know that I got married. I posted a picture and sort of like a little life update over there. Um, and it was really just the legal the legal aspect of, of my marriage, which really needed to be sorted out before we moved. Um, I will be planning my proper church wedding for the not too distant future. And so those are the two, those are the two things, you know, that have been, um, yeah, kind of a mystery, I suppose, for you guys. But the news that I'm going to reveal today, the really big news, the really exciting news, um, the most juicy piece of information I'm going to reveal to you uh, right here now. Uh, and you may already know because I may have given you a hint in the title, uh, like clickbait style. <laughs> but, um, so the big news is that I'm pregnant. I'm in my second trimester. I'm not going to say exactly right yet, you know, how far I am into the pregnancy, but I'm in the second trimester. Um, I know the gender, which I will reveal later on as well. I'm really going to milk it. I'm not going to reveal everything right away, guys. <laughs> um, you're going to have to wait. I'm going to drip feed you the information. But uh, I'm pregnant, I'm married, and I made it to the countryside. So I am feeling so blessed that all of these things actually came together. These are the things that I have been talking about on this channel um, for a very long time. I've been promoting, you know, the traditional lifestyle, promoting family values, promoting like, you know, revolting against the modern world and, and finding the good life, the simple life. And now it's time for me to practice what um, I have been preaching. You know, what kind of person would I be if I'm here on the internet, you know, telling other women, you know, get your family in order. Um, <laughs> if I'm not gonna do it myself. And so I really thought long and hard about whether or not I was going to, you know, just maybe I, I thought about just deleting my account for a while because it's, this is a very vulnerable position that I'm putting myself in right now. Um, there are many women, I think, uh, who are in the sort of political right-wing side of YouTube 
who would rightfully want to just sort of exit at this point um, and focus on their, their life and their health and uh, their family. And I completely respect and completely understand that because I, ha I have been considering whether or not I should do the same thing. Um, on the other hand, I think that I should be courageous because now I really have something to offer other than just like my opinions and my ideas, which you can get anywhere, you know? Everyone knows what, what, what the talking points are. This is what we're for. This is what we're against. This is why this is bad. This, you've heard, you've heard it, you've heard it all over and over and over again for the past three years. It's not really much new information that you're getting. You know, how many, how many um, videos can you really watch about immigration, you know, or the importance of border security or like, just like general degeneracy um, that's happening in our societies right now. There is a lot of that. And I think that on the one hand, while it's important to expose the bad things that are happening and to push back against them, we on the right wing, I think, often forget to promote what it is that we um, really believe in by, you know, living what we living what we say that we should do. And now that I am about to become a mom, which I'm extremely excited about, uh, I want to um, continue doing my Girl Talk series, but I also want to start focusing on. Um, like mom content, which is going to be really different for a lot of my old time viewers. Um, it's not going to be that interesting for dudes um, and like the my male audience, uh, unless you are, you know, trying to conceive with your wife or, you know, maybe you're a father yourself um, or I don't know, you have a sister who you want to help out. You want to share my videos to a woman who is important to you in your life. Um, but. I've been shifting my focus towards content for women for a while now, and that's not, that's only going to continue. Um, I want to make a video, um, you know, about you know my first trimester, my experiences, trying to conceive, fertility, um, you know, the sort of supplements and vitamins I take, um, things that I have learned and educated myself uh, about using you know podcasts and books and all kinds of stuff um, that I want to share with women who are like me who are also either moving into motherhood or are attempting to do that. So uh, that's the direction that I'm headed in now. I want to, you know, I'm sick of just talking about ideas, you know. Um, there will always be an element of that on this channel, I think. I don't know if that part of my personality is going anywhere, but um, I want to make content about the meaning that I've created in my life. Um, you know, by the grace of God, I've been blessed with um, having all of my prayers answered. And um, there has been an active participation in making these things come to fruition on my part. And I want to show you that if someone like me can do it, and many of you saw the state that I was in when I started this channel. You know, I was at, you know, square one. Couldn't even articulate what it was that I wanted properly. To be here now, a few short years later, if I can do it, anyone can do it. And I think we on the right wing, we need more visual representation of happy, family-oriented, healthy, traditionally-minded uh, people who are manifesting good in the world and inspiring you to do the same and to believe that you can do it too. It doesn't matter what stage in this process that you are. You can be single, stuck in a city, start small, you know, and that's what this channel is going to be about. It's going to be about um, sharing and educating uh, about those things and trying to inspire others to at least to some degree um, turning away from um, the constant, you know, bombardment of like reasons to be blackpilled and to be hopeless and um, to remind you that um, despair is, you know, it's a sin. Um, we need to focus on the things that are important to us in our real lives, prioritize our family, take on responsibility um, and build. 
We need to build something for ourselves that um, you know is worth fighting for. Because it, if we're just on the internet, like you know, doing news coverage and um, you know lamenting yet another degenerate display in the news or like whatever it is, like like is that benefiting your life? Really? Like it doesn't benefit mine. Like I'm low key addicted to this kind of like news cycle thing, you know, and it's not, it's not great for me, but I have prioritized, um, making something for myself and building my life. And now it's time to share with you that process. So, um, I'm so excited guys. I'm so happy. I'm so excited. I'm so grateful. I'm so full of hope about what the future Brit has, has in store for me. I'm so excited to be a mom. I'm so excited to share this with you. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm gonna leave it off there. There's gonna be lots more revealed soon. Uh, stay tuned. Thank you for listening. If you wanna support the channel or find me on other social media platforms, check out the links in the description. Um, subscribe if you're interested in this content because um, there's going to be a lot of good stuff, interesting stuff coming up, different stuff, fresh stuff, uh, in the, in the very, uh, few days to come, you know, I, I'm, I'm ready to roll now. So there's going to be new stuff soon. Thanks for listening guys. Take care. Bye.